All right, we've got another beautiful day in Bayview. I don't know how it is that I keep lucking out and I'm here on beautiful days, but it's good because I've got paint drying. Good that it's nice and warm. These are the uh, rails uh, for the X and Y axes for the router. Uh, last weekend, I had them all drilled, or I, well, I drilled them, my uh, father-in-law and I. Uh, and yesterday I prepped them, and today uh, they're getting painted. Um, it was a, a huge amount of work uh, getting them all prepped, getting all the uh, uh, surface rust and crap off of them. Um, I haven't done a whole lot besides that in the last couple weeks, except spend money. See, I've got a box full of parts from CNC router parts. Um, it looks rifled through, but when I got it, it was nice, beautifully packed. Um, I bought a new uh, a router. Well, it's not new; it's used. I got it off Craigslist for 80 bucks. A nice little Makita. Um, so, some other money that I've spent. There's a giant piece of 8020 over here. This is a 3060, <clears throat> 54 inches long. Looking at about uh, $200 worth of aluminum. Uh, well, I, that includes shipping, I suppose. Um, the other thing I did um, is I got I got my uh, uh, leveling feet. Um, the uh, the table that I had, well, that that I that I salvaged, it came with these. I mean, j just just as you see them, with one foot and then two kind of stubs. Um, I was going to just uh, get a get a fourth plate for to fit this size and get another one of these, but it actually turned out to be more economical to just start from scratch. And I got a whole set of leveling feet, um, and the plates I made myself. This is just a. Uh, uh, three inch wide uh, aluminum um, that I had them cut down to well roughly, roughly three inches and then I finished it on the mill um, drilled the clearance holes for five sixteenths and then uh, uh, this is a half inch 13 uh, tapped thread um, so that I'm quite pleased with how they turned out this the, the whole four of them were I think uh, uh, twenty eight dollars uh, uh, with free shipping from I think it was J.W. Winco. Um, they're technically um, less heavy duty than, than, than the big metal ones would have been. Um, the uh, metal ones, I think they wanted something like uh, $15 a piece for those. Uh, but still, even they call these medium duty, they're still good to 4,000 pounds or something ridic ridiculous like that. Um, so th these, these plates came from 8020 and they're a little bit beefier but um, I think the half inch thick here will be just fine. Um, we're not, I'm not going to be parking a car on this thing or anything. So, uh, uh, so yeah, so hopefully today I'll be able to uh, get the last uh, coats of paint on the rails. Um, I'll get those table legs mounted to the table and I'll actually have a table standing up off the ground. All right, thanks.